Only five months are left for your NEET 2025 examination. And I know a lot of NEET aspirants, I would say maximum number of serious NEET aspirants are worried at this point of time. So is it possible for me to crack this examination in the upcoming five months if I start preparing right now? My dear friends, I can give you the tons and tons of examples of those students who have done it before in the last five months, in the last six months. If they did it, why cannot you? But, but, they followed the proper plan. They had the proper strategy. It's not like every student will come up at this point of time, sir, I'll give my 100%, I'll start preparing, okay? And sir, I'll crack the need. No, 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 no. There has to be the proper strategy. You should know what are the topics that you guys are supposed to focus first, what are the topics you have to give the first priority and what are the topics you, you are supposed to do at the end, okay? All those things matter, okay? It's not like you have to go in a random way or in a messy way. You have to follow the proper plan and the proper strategy. So in this particular video, my dear friends, do like this particular video and do share it with all those serious need aspirants who have the aim to crack this examination in the 2025 in these last five months, okay? I'll be talking about the 50 topics which are going to help you to crack your NEET examination and, and, and. This is not, this is, I have done the complete and proper analysis of the past 10 years of the NEET, past 10 years papers, okay? And based on that, I have come up with these topics and I'll be telling you over here. And we are getting the calls from different number of students out there. Sir, I am worried at this point of time. Anxiety level has increased. Sir, is it possible for me? If it is possible, please tell me the way so that I can follow that proper way, proper plan. Tell me the topics which I am supposed to priority, which I, I am supposed to give the first priority so that, so that I can enter the safe score. And since you guys know that the cutoff is going to be between 620 to 640. So you have to be extremely smart for the NEET 2025 examination, okay? It's not like you have to just get 550 marks. You have to get, we say, you should make your target score 660 plus. For that, you have to be very smart. For that, you have to focus on all of those topics which are highly important. You should know from which chapter, how many number of questions are coming. Now, my dear friends, in this particular video, do share this and do like this particular video. I would want you guys to share it with all those serious NEET aspirants who have the aim to become the doctor in the upcoming time. Let's start with the physics, my dear friends. The very first thing over here, when it comes to the physics, listen to me very carefully. This modern physics portion, be it NEET or be it JE, this is extremely important. Okay, you can expect, we say, minimum of nine questions and maximum it can go up to 13. And sometimes it has been seen that 15 questions have been asked. I won't say this time 15, I would say from nine to 13 or nine to 12, you guys can expect from the modern physics. And when it comes to the modern physics, I say dual nature, matter, okay. Uh, dual nature of matter and radiations is the first chapter and then atoms and nuclei this is the second chapter I consider this one chapter only and then you have the semiconductors extremely easy if you study with me the modern physics okay we can complete this modern physics just in few days and and all of those questions all of those marks will be in your hands that's for sure okay and this is and when it comes to the modern physics my dear friends you guys are supposed to make the formula sheet extremely important because there are a lot of formulas when it comes to the modern physics, okay? You guys are supposed to make the formula sheet separately for the modern physics. And previous year questions must be done. You don't have to go in the entire or much detail. You just have to remember the formulas and the concepts, that's all. You would be able to solve every single problem for the from the modern physics. That's my guarantee. I'm telling you that. Next, we have over here electrostatics extremely high weighted chapter okay you guys can expect four to five questions from the electrostatics and when it comes to the electrostatics guys over here if this is divided into three sub chapters you can't say these are the chapters subtopics you you guys can say over here electric charts and fields electric potential and capacitance over here and there are a lot of formulas you will see in the chapter electrostatics uh, in the chapter electrostatics okay so here also i would recommend you guys to make the formula sheet along with that you will have to make the proper notes okay or the revision notes that is very important in this case also and previous year questions must be done over here okay this is not something in which you have to use your brain or mind just the formula based chapter that's it then my dear friends we say 
kinematics we have been studying the kinematics from a very long time even since class 9th okay extremely easy you have one dimensional motion two dimensional motion and relative motion over here okay and and you will basically you will feel this chapter is extremely easy because you have been studying this chapter from your class 9th okay and then then we say newton's laws of motion nothing you have to do over here just the pseudo force okay free body diagram and the three laws of motion okay that's what you guys are supposed to remember over here so these are the two important chapters from the 11th portion i must say when it comes to the neat physics okay then current electricity extremely important we say four to five questions and sure in this particular case drift velocity mobility and we say those measuring instruments like potentiometer no potentiometer is deleted by the way we say conversion of a meter galvanometer into a meter conversion of galvanometer into voltmeter meter bridge all of those are important when it comes to the current electricity and those circuits okay like the midpoint formula and all so you guys are supposed to do you can expect four to five questions because we have been seeing from the past years four to five questions have been asked from the current electricity portion also and then we have the optics when it comes to the chapter optics guys listen to me very carefully this chapter people feel this is difficult but it is extremely easy see when it comes to the chapter optics if you follow the proper sequence in this chapter it will become extremely easy that is my guarantee okay and here also you'll see a lot of formulas so try to make the formula sheet separately for this particular chapter it will become easy that's for sure and then you have the thermodynamics two to three questions you can expect from this chapter also when it comes to the neat physics okay gravitation extremely important from your class 11 portion and units and dimensions okay do not underestimate this particular chapter because it is very important it is small even if you sit for four to five hours you would be able to finish this entire chapter and and there are some measuring instruments in this chapter at the end and the dimensional analysis you have to understand over here you are done with this chapter also and you can expect three to four questions from this small chapter okay so this was all about we say physics this was all about physics now my dear friends let me just talk about the chemistry and and in the chemistry i'll not talk about only the topics but i'll be telling you i'll not talk about only the chapters but i'll be talking about the topics also what are the important topics that you need to focus on because as i told you i have done the complete analysis of the past previous year papers and i have discussed with some of the top educators out there also about this particular video now guys before this before this let me just tell you something there are a lot of students who are saying sir you are telling us about these topics okay this is important that is important you are telling us which uh, road map we are supposed to follow we are coming up with the timetable please guide us properly please teach us all of these chapters so that we can enter the medical college in the upcoming time okay please teach from the scratch from the basics if you are saying sir four to five questions are coming from this particular chapter please teach us those four to five questions Please teach us all of those topics so that we do not miss any of these questions so that it feels like we are when we are writing the examination tomorrow in the NEET 2025 it feels like we have studied we have studied everything previously in in that particular batch okay now for that now for that my dear friends we are coming up with a batch that is called the NEET 2025 Avengers batch okay in this particular batch whatever the topics I have told you as of now every all of those topics will be given the first priority sir what about the rest of the topics or the chapters see when it comes to the rest of the topics or the chapters my dear friends listen to me very carefully we will be given them also priority but once we get done with these important chapters okay important topics because you will have to enter the medical college in the upcoming time okay so for that for that you should have the safe you should cross the safe score initially then only we can aim for the we say AIRs or something like that okay now when it comes to the NEET 2025 Avengers batch guys see see we say this batch is going to start from 10th of December and syllabus will be completed we say till 20th of march this will be the kind of 100 days challenge uh, okay and in this particular batch let me just tell you we will be completing our syllabus between 100 and 120 days okay so what afterwards what after that so we'll be coming up with the revision session so that whatever we have studied all of those will be revised properly sir will this be the revision batch or this will be the completely from this will be completely from the scratch from the basics let me just tell you this will be completely from the basics from the scratch 
if you are learning for the first time any particular chapter, you would be able to understand in this particular batch, that is our guarantee, that is my guarantee. Okay, and we say theory and problems, okay, everything will be there like DPPs, NCRT questions, tests will be on every Sundays because when it comes to the NEET examination, if you do not give the proper test, it is impossible for you to crack the NEET. Even if you have studied, if you even if you have do the revisions and all, tests are very much important. So that's why we have kept the tests over here also. Okay, and there is a special surprise in this particular batch. And what is that surprise, my dear friends? Let me just tell you, for the first time in the history of an academy, I would say, Vaseem sir is going to teach, Vaseem sir is going to teach the complete organic chemistry of class 11th, of class 12th, in this particular batch. Even he'll be completing your physical chemistry also for class 11th, for class 12th, okay, and some chapters of inorganic chemistry. Almost, I say, the complete chemistry will be done by the uh, one and only Vaseem sir. And, and then afterwards, my dear friends, I'll be completing your physics when it comes to the class 11th as well as class 12th. And, and all the people were requesting me over there, sir, please start the class 11th portion. Please start the class 11th portion. And in this particular batch, I'll be starting the class 11th portion. I'll start from the scratch, from the basics, okay, like basic mathematics and vectors. That will be the first chapter I'm taking. Okay, then you have the HSP, sir. He'll be also taking some of the chapters of the chemistry over here. And Ambika, ma'am, okay, you know about the queen of biology. And along with her, there is one more educator. She will be joining. She'll be joining for the biology. And that is also a surprise for you guys, okay? An amazing educator. So this is the batch in which all the things are covered, okay? From the basics, all the things will be taught from the basics. Every single thing, be it the pro problems, be it the theory, every single thing. And this is starting from, we say, 10th of December. If you have not joined this particular batch, as of now, I would recommend you to join uh, it as soon as possible, okay? And and the price is, for the first 500 students, it's just 3499. The link is in the description below. Click onto that link and join this particular session as soon as possible. And then, my dear friends, let's move on to, let's move on to the chemistry portion over here. When it comes to the chemistry, see, see, see. We say, we say, the first chapter that I would recommend you to go with is the chemical bonding. Four to five questions you can expect from this chemical bonding chapter, okay? And this is of your inorganic chemistry. And in this chapter, let me just tell you, do not leave the molecular orbital theory from this particular chapter, okay? You don't have to leave this particular topic because you can expect this, you can expect a question from this particular topic, okay? And then you have Vesper theory, very, very important, okay? Question comes every single year. Then you have valence bond theory, then you have hybridization over here, okay? And we have bond parameters like bond angle and bond length. These are the topics that you need to cover in this particular chapter when it comes to the NEET 2025, okay? And then my dear friends, when it comes to, when it comes to, we say, uh, the second one, that's what we call the equilibrium. Guys, when it comes to the equilibrium, you have chemical and ionic equilibrium over here. And in this chemical and ionic equilibrium, let me just tell you over here. Guys, see, solubility product, these are the important topics over here. We say factors affecting the equilibrium. So we say a theoretical question can be expected from this particular topic over here. We say concept of pH, acid and base concept, okay? Salt, we say hydrolysis is uh, important in this one also. And then you have in thermodynamics, we have thermochemistry, okay? and spontaneity and this will be in what the thermodynamics and you can expect two to three questions from this particular chapter also then 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 when it comes to the we say a next chapter that is hydrocarbons okay in case of hydrocarbons we say a lot of questions are expected from this one okay and then you have aromatic hydrocarbons over here maximum chances of getting questions from this one is from the hi aromatic hydrocarbons okay and then you have alkynes three bond and then you have we say alkenes okay like you have over here substitution reaction addition reaction snr1 snr2 all of these are important when it comes to the alkenes and then we have d and f block and in this case you have to prepare kmno4 okay we say genetic trends okay and lanthanoid series in this particular case also and then you have the next chapter that is coordination compounds. We have the valence bond theory. We have the bond and metal carbon nils, okay? And then you have Werner's theory, okay? And IUPAC nomenclature. 
So this is from the chapter that is coordination and compounds. Then you have the electrochemistry. When it comes to the electrochemistry, very, very important two questions you can expect from this chapter. We say Faraday's law, Gibbs free energy, EMF of cell, we say Nernest equation. So these are the important topics you have over here. Then you have the solutions. Okay. In this case, molarity, molality, mole concept, all of these are important. Okay. Organic chemistry. In organic chemistry, you have the IUPAC nomenclature. One question you can expect from this. Okay. Then you have the aldehydes, ketones, carboxylic acids and, and mixed conversion of benzene. Okay qualitative and quantitative and qualitative uh, qualitative analysis okay so this is what you are supposed to do in this one then my dear friends comes the biology when it comes to the biology portion over sure you have got the cell biology four to five questions you can expect from the cell biology itself then you have the plant kingdom two to three questions you can expect from this one then you have the animal kingdom, four to five questions you can expect from this one, that is 12 to 20 marks from this. And then my dear friends, we can say biotechnology, processes and principles, five to six questions, all of these are the chapters which are having extremely huge weightage or the high weightage, we say from the biology portion, okay. And then you have the biotechnology applications, two to three questions from this one. You have the cell cycle and divisions, four to five questions. You have the biomolecules, two to three questions. You have the plant growth and development. We said three to four questions in this one. And then we say molecular basis of inheritance, eight to 10 questions. Principles of inheritance, two to three questions. Human health and diseases, three to four questions, okay? And then you have anatomy and morphology of, we say flowering plants, okay? Three to four questions from this one. Then you have the biomolecules, sexual reproduction in humans, okay? Here you can expect three to four questions, two to three questions from the sexual reproduction portion. Okay, you have evolution, two to three questions. You have ecosystem, three to four questions. You have organisms and population, we say four to five questions. So guys, that's why we say you can see all of these chapters are having extremely huge or high weightage. Okay, that's why we say biology, you are supposed to give the first priority when it comes to the NEET examination. Sir, shall I give the... Is it possible for me to crack the NEET? With just two subjects, it is impossible. You have to prepare all the three, but the first priority among all the three should be biology. Keep that thing in your mind, okay? But you have to prepare all three, and that too, that too uh, from the scratch till the end, you should get the maximum marks in all the three, okay? But first priority should be your biology when it comes to the NEET 2020 five examination okay so this was all about it my dear friends so if you want to complete all of these chapters if you want to get the maximum marks in the knee 2025 okay so then i would recommend you guys to join this avengers batch okay which will be started from 10th of december okay join as soon as possible the link is in the description below click on to that link and, and you will be enrolled in this particular batch so that you do not miss any of the lectures out there which are starting from the uh first itself okay so that's all about it my dear friends do share this video with all of your friends out there so that this information can reach them so that they can get this information so take care and bye bye thank you so much take care